I thought I'd show how to make a uh, twin stick like shooter, I guess, or aimer at least, um, using a puppet. Uh, I've just got a, a blank puppet here and I opened the chip and it has a left stick out which is used for the walk and it's got also got a right stick which works the same as the left stick. The left stick is so I'm looking over here, so pushing up goes oh, pushing up goes in that direction. But if I'm looking over here, up goes in that direction. So it's camera relative. So we can use the same thing for the right stick for aiming uh, our little guy. And uh, I think we can just plug that into turn to face. So I'm going to try that. I think it's working. Um, so now we'd have like... Um, Let's make a global chip. If you have um, stuff that's just going to be in the scene, um, I like to make a big old giant chip so that you can see it and never lose it. And then have its window open like that. And save the position so it saves this size. And then I... Uh, yeah, we want to add a camera pointer. So you can do that. You can... Um, you can scope, uh, scope into a camera pointer and then just move around as if you were moving the normal create mode camera and get the right angle. So now I'll scope out and now if I click on that it has that point and the uh, those settings for that angle. So now when I play I will probably want to use a kind of pseudo hidden feature of the camera pointer which is the zoom multiplier. If we turn that up a bit, then that will zoom out while the uh, pointer is working. So now I can run around, but while I hold the right stick, it kind of looks in that direction. And then when I don't hold the right stick, then it looks in the direction that we're running in. So um, we may want to turn up the turn speed like that. Yeah, like that. Um, and now we will we'll probably want to have uh, have some other pose going on. Um, so we want to know if the right stick is being pushed or not. Um, for that, uh, we use a value slider, and we don't need it to have the slider part. And we just plug that in there. Um, this is because the fat wire actually gives us the distance from zero that that. Uh, kind of vector is so in this case how far you're pushing the right stick um, but to make sure we're just getting that value we can put it through a value slider and then we'll get it out the other side um, and I'll put this in a chip like so um, and then we'll check if that is greater than some number to make sure it's being pushed enough and if it is we'll pose the puppet so we'll scope in here and we'll just like bring its hands up like that I will use the mirror mode so we can just move one hand and the other one matches it like that so now he's just pointing his hands in one direction while the right stick is pushed enough. Uh, go into the controller sensor and turn on force uh, possession and now it just gets possessed when you start playing. So now if I push right on the right stick it's immediately like pointing a gun or like aiming his magic hands or whatever um, in that direction. I'd like to thank Mobius DT X Cantaloupe, Dead MC, and all of my other supporters for making this tutorial possible. Thanks for watching. If you'd like me to continue making these tutorials and helping creators across the internet, you can find out how to support me in the link in the description. Thanks for your consideration, and I'll see you in the next one.